Hey guys, it's Hannah. Welcome back to my channel. Oh my gosh, it's been forever since I have posted a video. I'm pretty sure at this point it has been almost a year. So, hi, welcome back. I've got a lot to catch you guys up on. So, for a fun little video to just catch you guys up on where I've been, what I've been doing, I thought it'd be fun to show you a makeup routine kind of my everyday makeup routine that I've been doing lately with some new products that I've been loving. And we're just gonna talk about my life, what I've been doing for the past year. First things first, I need to tie my hair up. Let's get crack a lacking. Okay. It might not be the cutest thing, but it is what it is. Sorry if the lighting is kind of weird. It's a weird time of day that I'm doing this. So first things first, I'm gonna use the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Primer. So the last thing that you guys saw of my life was me in college. It was my first semester of freshman year. Long story short, I went home over Christmas break and realized that I really didn't want to go back to my school, to college in general, and I really was positive that I wanted to go to cosmetology school. I talked to the people in my life about it. Everyone was encouraging me to do it. It wasn't even my, school, my school's fault. I really didn't have that much of a problem with my school. It was just college in general. I felt like it wasn't where I was supposed to be at the time. Next up, we're gonna use the YSL skin tint. This is in shade 3. I really was enjoying being back at home and I really had no interest in doing college period. Pretty much since the beginning of high school I had always been saying like oh I'm gonna drop out of college or not even go and um, go to cosmetology school. I gave college a try and it was absolutely not it for me at the time. We'll get into that more later. Are you filming right now? Yeah. Oh, hi, you too. <laughs> <laughs> I specifically remember talking to one of my friends. My friend Callie and I were driving, um, going to lunch or something. I'm using the Kosas Concealer right now. Kosas Concealer. Love her. And I was telling her about it, and she was like, dude, just do it. And I was like, okay <laughs> she was the first one that really kind of put me in the mindset like oh i actually can do this if i want to like i don't have to go back to college nobody's gonna force me to i went home that night and i actually did my research about it and i thought about it in depth before i said anything else to anybody the next day i texted my parents because if you didn't know after i went to college my parents like sold our house and they got an rv and they were traveling for a while but they were in town um, at the time. So I texted them and I was like, hey, like, can we go get breakfast tomorrow? I want to talk to you guys about something. I told them what I wanted to do, how I wanted to leave college and try cosmetology school or esthetician school because I, before doing my research, I didn't really know what an esthetician was. I didn't know esthetician school was even a thing. And then in my research of cosmetology school, I found out about it and I was like, oh wow, that is what I want to do. Skincare, makeup, facials, all of that. I want to do that. The next day, or it might have honestly been that night, I went online and I canceled all of my financial aid stuff, unenrolled from all of my spring semester classes. Obviously, some of you know I was in a sorority. I had to like drop out of my sorority, which was so freaking sad. Shout out to AOPI, Arkansas State University. Love y'all. Okay, next thing I'm going to use is the Charlotte Tilbury Contour Wand. And then it was time to figure out my plan for going to esthetician school. There weren't really any great esthetician school options near me. There were great options if I wanted to go to cosmetology school, but um, not really for aesthetics. I kind of decided like, okay, I'm not in a rush. I graduated high school a year early, so there's no reason for me to be rushing so much to start esthetician school. Um, I have time to think about it and create a plan and make sure everything is in order. I decided to take the next spring semester off of school in general. I'm so glad I took that time because I knew that I needed more time to kind of think about what I wanted to do exactly, and I got a job at Starbucks 
and I got an apartment and it was great. I moved to like a new city near my town and had some time to recoup and it was great for me. For blush, I'm gonna use the Glossier Cloud Paint. That time away from school really allowed me to make a solid plan. So during this time, my sister was still going to school um, where I had gone to college, Arkansas State University. She was making plans to move to a new city after college. I wasn't sure that I wanted to, the blush on my hand, cool. I wasn't 100% sure that I wanted to stay in Arkansas to go to school because there was really only one good option and I felt super, super limited and I didn't want to have to limit myself. Now I'm gonna use the highlighter wand from Charlotte Tilbury. I looked at schools where my sister was moving and I found a great one and um, I got in contact with them, you know, I applied, I went to the school and like toured. It's a great school in a great city. Fast forward a couple of months, that's where I'm going to school now. I'm in esthetician school, I am about four months deep into it and I absolutely love it, I love it. When I told my parents that I was gonna come to school, where my sister was, they were like, okay, well, if both of our kids are going there, maybe we should too. So my parents just bought a house here. I moved back in with my parents and I'm so grateful for them. Really rock star parents. Shout out to you guys. Love you mom, love you dad. I got this little eyeshadow palette from ColourPop. It's their nude mood palette. It's literally so pretty. Usually I use this Benefit Brow Setter stuff, but I already used it today because I do it in the morning. I'm going to go in with the Maybelline Sky High Mascara. I absolutely love school. It is so fun. I've learned so much and it's something I'm genuinely passionate about. I actually want to be there. I want to go to class. I want to finish. I want to graduate and I have such a drive to finish. <sighs> no. I did just also apply to go back to college. Let me explain myself. Part of me really wants to have a college education to fall back on um, because I do love esthetician school, but I don't know if I a thousand percent can see myself doing it forever. Now I'm considering going back to school and getting a degree. I honestly don't know what's gonna happen. I don't know how it's gonna play, play out. Um, I'm gonna take some college courses next semester and kind of just see how it goes. I graduate esthetician school in January. Um, I'm gonna use this lip gloss. This is the Maybelline Lifter Gloss. Um, and this is in the shade 002 Ice. That is what's been going on in my life for the past year. As for why I stopped making videos, I honestly don't know. I know I don't have like a million subscribers right now, but I don't care. I honestly just really like doing it. I like filming, I like editing, I like coming up with ideas for videos, and I really miss doing it. And I've honestly felt that way for a really long time. After I dropped out, I just kind of felt like I was in a rut for a long time where there was nothing really interesting that I was doing. I discouraged myself from making videos again for a long time. Now I feel like I'm at the point where I'm super motivated again. Since last time I filmed, I got a new camera. What do we think about the quality? I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, let me know and I would love to answer them. And also drop any suggestions for any videos that you guys want to see and make sure to like and subscribe i don't know how often i'm gonna post i'm gonna figure that out as time goes by but for now turn my post notifications on so you know every time i post a new video that's all i have for now so love you the most thanks for coming to see me after a year of me being gone i love y'all and i will see you in my next video